president will be implementing tomorrow, a 25% tariffs on Mexico, 25% tariffs on Canada, and a 10% tariff on China uh, for the illegal fentanyl that they have sourced and allowed to distribute into our country. Mr. Pillsbury, the leading authority on China, he was on a good show, I won't mention the name of the show, recently, and he was saying that China has total respect for Donald Trump and for Donald Trump's very, very large brain. He said, took power in 2011 and since then he hadn't left his country until March where he took his first trip uh, to Beijing and then he took that short step over the border to meet President Moon of South Korea and here he is ahead of any summit, any planned summit with President Trump once again meeting the President of China. There are two things come to mind. First of all, trade. North Korea's key ally, key trade partner is China. Over 80% of North Korea's trade is with China. If North Korea wants to try to get its Please raise your right hand and repeat after me. I, Donald John Trump, do solemnly swear I, Donald John Trump, do solemnly swear that I will faithfully execute that I will faithfully execute the office of President of the United States the office of President of the United States and will, to the best of my ability and will, to the best of my ability preserve, protect, and defend preserve, protect, and defend the Constitution of the United States the Constitution of the United States so help me God绝不允许任何外来势力欺负、压迫、奴役我们，谁妄想这样干，必将在十四多亿中国人民用血肉铸成的钢铁长城面前碰得头破血流。
there should be some consequences if in the end you know, China was responsible for all of this? Well, if they were knowingly responsible, certainly, if they did, if it was a mistake, a mistake is a mistake. But if they were knowingly responsible, yeah, no issue. Well, China is also the issue that there uh, was a rest in the meeting with the president. Uh, it was the issue that uh, the president will uh, meet uh, next uh, uh, Monday. Uh, and uh, what we see is that, of course, the rise of China poses some opportunities for our economies uh, for, for, for trade and we need to, uh, to talk uh, to China on issues like and engage with China on issues like climate change and arms control. At the same time, uh, China was soon had the biggest economy in the world. They only had the second, the second largest defense budget, uh, the biggest navy. They're investing heavily in uh, advanced military capabilities and they don't share our values. We see that in the way they crack down on democratic protests uh, uh, in, uh, in, uh, in Hong Kong, how they uh, deal with minorities.